Hi, everybody. How are you doing today? It's great to see you. Look at this. I'm making snow. Well, it's magic snow. All you have to do is add some water to a special powder, and it fluffs up and becomes snow. Isn't it beautiful? We're going to be making lots of snow in the classroom today, plus much more. So I hope you're ready. Welcome to my classroom. Hi everybody, welcome, come on in. We are talking all about snow today. And check this out, I'm making some magic snow. All you have to do is add some water to the special powder and it fluffs up just like snow. Look at it grow, isn't that amazing? It's just like snow. Now, I know you might be thinking, Katie, snow is over. But there's a lot of places out there in the world that still have snow, and maybe a lot of snow. Does it snow where you are? Or maybe it's snowing right now. We have classmates who watch from all over the world. So the weather's going to be different in different places. And maybe it's snowing. Let's take a look outside the window here in the classroom and see what the weather's like outside here today. Ooh, look at that. I see fluffy clouds and white snowflakes falling from the sky. It's snowing outside today. It must be pretty cold. I see the weather is very good today in Turkey. That's great to hear. No snow in Florida, probably not, and also not in North Korea or in Korea. Thanks for sharing the weather with me, everybody. Even if you don't have snow, like in Florida or in Korea, let's pretend that we're playing with the snow. Let's gather up a bunch of snow off the ground. Here we go. Whew, I got a bunch. Let's pat it together to make a big snowball. Pat, pat, pat. Wow, look at this big snowball. Now let's gently toss our snowball to a friend. I'm gonna toss mine to Diego in New York City. Here it comes, Diego. Got you. Let's make another big snowball. Here it comes. I'm throwing this one to all our friends watching in China. Got you. It's lots of fun to play in the snow and we're gonna be doing lots of that today, but first, Let's wave our hands, stomp our feet, and clap all together to our big hello song. Are you ready? Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Hello, hello. Can you clap your hands? Can you stretch up high? Stretch up. Can you touch your toes? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Hello. All right, a big hello to Landon, Victoria, and baby Alex from Illinois, Isaac and Azrael from the UK, and Vihan and Vevu in India. Nice to see you. Let's get ready to stomp our feet. Hello, hello. Can you stamp your feet? Hello, hello. Can you stamp your feet? Can you stretch up high? Stretch up. Can you touch your toes down low? Can you turn around? Can you say hello? Hello! A big hello to Ian and Lisa from Brazil, Sarah Sheeran in India, Judah and Asher in Saskatchewan, Canada. Thanks for joining us, everybody. Let's wave our hands and stomp our feet one more time. Hello, hello. Hi. Can you clap your hands? Hello, hello, can you stamp your feet? 
Nice job, everyone. Hello to everybody watching. Take a look at what I have here. Aha. This is the letter S. Can you say this letter with me? Let's hear it. Oh, we can do a little bit louder all together. What's this letter? S, that's it. What are some words that start with the letter S? Can you think of any words that start with the letter S? Hmm. I got one. Let's spell it out. S, N, O, W, snow. That's a word that starts with the letter S. Ashley says the word snake. That's a great word that starts with the letter S. Lots of our friends are saying snow and star and special. Those are all great words that start with the letter S. One of our friends, Moon, says super simple songs. Those are lots of words that start with the letter S. The word snow also makes up a lot of other words like snowman or snowball or snowflake. Let's make some more snowflakes with our magic snow and I'll show you how I do it too. All right, let's get a new plate out so I can show you how to make this special snow. This is the magic snow powder. You put some out on the plate like this. There you go. Now all we have to do is add water. And look, it fluffs right up. It's getting so big. It becomes fluffy snow. Let's see if we can get it really big. Wow. The more water we add, the more it fluffs up. Let's see. Look at that. It became like fluffy snow. That's magical, isn't it? Let's see if we can get it to fluff up some more. Add some more water. Wow, it still grows. Look at that. Hmm. You know, I wonder, do you think if we used colored water instead of clear water, do you think that that would make colored snow? Hmm, I wonder. Let's try. Let's try making some colored snow. All right, we got some different colors here. How about green, blue, and red? Let me know what your favorite color is and we'll try making snow that color. Some more plates out. How about we start with blue? Blue's my favorite color. Let's try and make some blue snow. I wonder if it'll work. Do you think it's gonna turn blue? Put down some of our magic snow powder. Cora and Moon like blue too. All right, let's try the blue. Here it comes. turning blue. Look at that. Blue snow. Isn't that silly? We can make lots and lots of snow. It's a beautiful blue color. Wow. It's fun squirting the water on it, too. <laughs> squirt, squirt. Squirt, squirt. <laughs> Let's see. Blue snowflakes. It 
kind of feels like snow too. It's just not as cold. But it's nice and fluffy. Well, I think it worked. We made some blue snow. Let's try another color. Nora and Bella say red. All right, let's get a red color here. Gotta add some more snow. Sloop. This is a lot. Okay, let's try red. I would imagine it would also turn red since the blue worked. Let's see, here it goes. Whoa. Wow, it just grows and grows. It's turning red. Well, it's kind of a pink color, isn't it? Like a light red. Wow. I like the red. All right, let's get lots of red water on there. Make it grow really big. Let's see how big we can make it. Here comes more. Woo! Let's see what red snowflakes look like falling from the sky. That's pretty. We have one color left. Let's make some green snow. That's Rocky and Gemma and Elijah's favorite color. How about we make some green snow on the orange plate? Let's try that. Put some more snow powder on. And here comes the green water. Ready? Go. Green means go. Here it comes. Oh, it's almost like it's erupting like a volcano. Wow, it gets so big so fast. It's really cool. Fluffs up just like snow. If you ever see snow falling, sometimes it doesn't look like much in the sky, but then after a while, you see the ground and there's lots of snow. Well, this snow turned green too. The magic snow is really beautiful. Let's see these green snowflakes falling from the sky. bring all the colors together. We got our green snow, our red snow, blue snow, and our fluffy white snow. The old original. Let's make it all snow at different times. My hand's gonna be the big cloud and we'll make the snowflakes fall. Look at that. Making a little mess in the classroom. <laughs> Snowing. Let's try the green and the red snowflakes. It's a big snowstorm in the classroom today. Beautiful snowflakes, aren't they? You know, all these falling snowflakes remind me of a song. Do you know the song, Little Snowflake? Let's sing that song together and you can make it snow using your fingers. I'll show you. Start with your fingers up high in the sky like this. And we'll give them a little wiggle like snowflakes flying through the air. And you'll see them falling, 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 all the way down to the ground. 
you can make it snow with me and we'll sing all together with the song Little Snowflake. All right. Got your snowflakes ready? Let's see them fall down. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake, little snowflake falling from the sky. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake falling, 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 falling on my head. Where's your head? Can you find your head? All the snowflakes are falling down. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake, little snowflake falling from the sky. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake falling, 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 falling on my nose. Can you find your nose? your nose. Imagine all your little snowflakes falling down on your nose. Wiggle them off. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake, little snowflake falling from the sky. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake falling, 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 falling on my hand. Can you reach out your hand to catch some snowflakes? Here they come, they're falling down right into your hand. Falling on my nose, falling on my hand. Snowflake, snowflake, little snowflake. Great singing, everybody, and great snowing. It's so nice to hear that you're singing and that the snowflakes are falling down where you are, too. It's so much fun when it snows outside because then it means we get to go outside in the snow and play, which is one of my favorite things to do when it snows. Let's take a field trip out into the snowy weather outside the classroom and we'll have a snowy adventure together. But first, we have to get dressed for the outside. It's very important to stay warm. So let's get on our boots. Ready? Got one boot on and the other boot on. Now that our boots are ready, what else do we need? How about a jacket. That's really important. Let's get our jacket on. One arm and the other arm. And don't forget to zip it up. Zip. Nice. Our jacket and boots are ready. What else? How about a hat? Let's put our hat on. Boop. Nice. That'll keep our head and our ears warm. What else? Oh, Samia so says hat. We got our hat ready. How about a scarf? That's important. Let's put our scarf on. Swoosh, 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 swoosh. That'll keep our neck warm. Bono Lisa from California says mittens. That's important to keep our hands warm. Let's get our mittens on. Gloves, that's it. Ophelia says, and Megan says snow pants. We already have our boots on, but let's pretend to put our snow pants on anyway. One leg. The next leg, Whew. must be getting all our stuff on. It's getting warm in here. I think it's time to head outside into the snowy weather and play in the snow. Are you ready? All right, let's go.
much fun to go out and play in the snow. I see our friend Gemma made a snow angel when she played in the snow with her daddy yesterday. Hosea really likes the snow. It's beautiful when it snows outside and really fun to play in the snow. Okay, let's take a look at that, on those snowflakes that I found outside in the park. Let's take a closer look here. Ooh, look at this. So these are real pictures of actual snowflakes. This is what snowflakes look like when they're up close under a microscope. Each snowflake has different shapes and it's different sizes. Snowflakes are made out of crystals that are made out of water. And when the water freezes, it makes a different shape every time. Every single snowflake that falls from the sky is different. Isn't that amazing? What do you think of these snowflakes? I think they're really beautiful and you can see lots of different shapes. It's amazing that every single snowflake is different, isn't it? Let's see if we can find some shapes in this snowflake I have here in the classroom. Can you find some different shapes in this snowflake? Hmm. Let's see if we can find some shapes and then we'll trace the shapes with a different color crayon. Can you see any shapes? It's a very pretty big shape, different from any other snowflake you might see. It is very pretty. I see some circles. Do you see the circles in the snowflake? I see a bunch of circles. Let's trace the circles the color orange. I got this orange crayon and we'll trace them like this. One big circle. Another big circle. There you go. Noah sees the circles. Nice big circles. How many circles are there? Let's count them. I see one, two, three, four, five, six. Six circles in this snowflake. Let's find some other shapes. Let's see. Amaya says she sees triangles. Yeah, I see some triangles too. Let's trace the triangles with the red crayon. One triangle, two triangles, three triangles, four triangles, five triangles, six triangles. Great job, Maya, you found them. This is going to be a colorful snowflake, just like those other snowflakes we made. Soren and Cameron say they see a diamond. Hmm, where's the diamond? Right here, right in the middle. Yeah, that's a beautiful diamond shape. Let's trace the diamond a purple color. We got our purple crayon. All four sides of our beautiful diamond. looking very pretty. Well, I see one more shape. Do you know what it is? Bruno and George say they see ovals. There's beautiful ovals around our snowflake. I see one, two, three, four, five, six ovals. Let's trace this with, ooh, how about green? A green color. All the way around. Ovals look like big eggs, don't they? This snowflake has lots of different shapes. Very special snowflake. Look at all the shapes we found. Oval, triangle, circle, and a diamond right there in the middle. 
Great work, everybody. I have another special snowflake here. What? Let's take a look. This one has a very special shape in the middle. What shape is this? This snowflake is pretty different from the other one. It has a couple different shapes in it. Hmm. This shape in the middle is another word that starts with the letter S, just like snow. It's a star. Darren sees the star in the middle of the snowflake. We'll trace it a nice bright yellow color. Great job, lots of our friends see the star. What other shapes do you see? Hmm, this one's a little tricky. Because it looks like it could be one shape this way. But if we move it sideways, it could be a different shape. Yeah, Lucia sees squares. Yeah, these are our squares. It looks like it could be a diamond this way. So it could be a diamond shape or a square. Let's trace that with a red crayon. There's one. Two, three, four. Four squares. And it's a pretty interesting shape, this whole snowflake, isn't it? Well, even though snowflakes are really small, they can fit in our hand and fall on our nose. When all those snowflakes come together, they can make something really big like a big snowball, and those snowballs can make a big snowman. Let's sing the song, I'm a Little Snowman together, and we'll pretend to be snowmen. Come on over. Let's get our big snow bodies ready to go. Follow along with me to I'm a Little Snowman. I'm a little snowman, look at me. These are my buttons, one, two, three. These are my eyes and this is my nose. I wear a hat and scarf, it's cold. It's cold outside. Whew. All right, everyone, follow along with me, pretending to be your snowman. Find your buttons, your eyes and your nose. Here we go. I'm a little snowman, look at me. These are my buttons. One, two, three. These are my eyes and this is my nose. I wear a hat and scarf. Ooh, it's cold. That's fun. Give yourselves a big clap. It's fun pretending to be snowmen. Even if you don't have snow, maybe you've never made a snowman before, you can make a snowman with some paint and some paper. I'm going to show you how. Let's make a snowman craft. We'll get out all the things we need to make our snowman craft. Put this stuff away. We're done playing with our snowflakes. Okay, we need lots of stuff to make our snowman craft. Here we go, scissors, paintbrush, all sorts of fun stuff. Lots of decorations for our snowman. And a blue piece of paper and some bubble wrap. This is really cool stuff that you, usually we just throw out, but we can recycle it with this craft. Now, if you want more details on how to make this, we have a link below that'll take you to our blog post and a video that'll go through it nice and slow. So after the live show, you can follow along and make your snowman craft together. Um, I'm just gonna show you really quick how we can put it together here in the classroom. So we need some white paint. That's gonna be snow. What we're gonna do is cover this bubble wrap with the white paint. Look at that, and then you can see all the different circles on the bubble wrap. And those are gonna become like snowballs. Make sure you get all the different bubbles on the bubble wrap. like that. This is really fun. Spread it all around. There we go. 
And then our bubble wrap is gonna be like a stamp. So we're gonna take our blue piece of paper and push it down on the bubble wrap like this. And then just gently give it a little push like it's a stamp. Then it's gonna peel right off. Let's take a look. Ooh, look at that. They look like snowballs. So once your snowball paper is dry, I got one here, you can keep going with your snowman. So what we're gonna do is make some big snowballs for our snowman. We're gonna use something to trace to make a circle. And we need three big snowballs for our snowman. One, two, three. These are big snowballs for our snowman body. Then you will use some scissors to cut them out and they'll look like this. One, two, three. Now we need to put our snowman body together. So we'll use a little bit of glue and stack them on top like this. It's looking more like a snowman already. Now our snowman is ready to decorate. Now this is a really fun part. So I have all sorts of di different decorations here in this cup. A special hat that I cut out for our snowman. A scarf. A bunch of pom-poms that are gonna be his buttons. I'm gonna get out three red pom-poms for our snowman. I got two googly eyes. There they are. And an orange carrot nose for our snowman. Now all we have to do is glue them all on. Let's start with the snowman's eyes. It's gonna really bring them to life. One there, one there. Make our snowman face. How about his carrot nose? Right in the middle. Let's put his buttons on. One, two, three. Just like in the song. He looks great. Our snowman needs his hat. Gotta keep our, our head warm. Ta-da! He looks great. And how about a nice scarf for our snowman, an orange scarf? I just cut a piece of ribbon, give it a bit of glue, and it'll go right there. Keep his neck nice and warm. Of course, our snowman needs a big smile. Let's use a black pencil crayon and give our snowman a nice big smile. All right. But we're not done yet. Let's give our snowman some arms. He needs arms so that he can dance around. We're gonna use this orange pipe cleaner and a hole punch here. So all we have to do is very carefully, and the grown-up might be good to help with this part, punch a little hole on either side of his body. Just like that. And then we can take our pipe cleaner and put it through the holes on the back like this. So now our snowman has arms. You can make little circles on either end of the arms and that'll be our snowman's mittens. So his hands stay warm. And finally, so that we can play with our snowman, we're gonna add on a popsicle stick like this so it can be a little snowman puppet we'll turn our snowman over line up our popsicle stick and for this part I like to use tape it stays nice and secure there a little bit more tape and look our snowman's done hello snowman say hello to everybody watching 
Let's sing I'm a Little Snowman one more time with our new snowman friend, okay? Are you ready, snowman? I'm ready. Here we go. I'm a little snowman, look at me. These are my buttons, one, two, three. These are my eyes and this is my nose. I wear a hat and scarf, Brrr, it's cold. Way to go, snowman, take a big bow. Thank you, thank you very much. <laughs> this snowman is so much fun to play with. Well, friends, it's almost time for us to say our goodbyes today in the classroom. But before we go, I wanted to share some more family photos with you. Because last week, we were talking all about family in the classroom and shared some family photos that some of our classmates sent in. And we got some more beautiful family pictures. So we're going to share some of them today. We got so many. So if you don't see yours today, tune in next week and we'll be showing some more too. All right, let's take a look at these beautiful families that we have watching. This is our friend Anna Sophia from Colombia with her mama and papa, beautiful family. These are, this is Cora and Eliza from the United States, they're sisters, and Cora made the baby shark craft. She did a great job. These are our friends Sejong and Yo Wong from South Korea, brother and sister with their mama and papa, looking very nice. This is our friend Eduardo from the USA. It looks like they're having a party. It looks like a great time. This is Ivana Sofia from Mexico with her mama and papa. Very sweet. This is our friend Ishan from India hanging out with his mama and they are twinning. They're dressing up like the same. This is our friend Kaylee in the USA, hanging out with her mama and papa. They look like they're having a fun time. Dad's being a little silly. And these are our friends, Joshua, Adrian, Matthew, Sarah, and Alexander, hanging out with mama and papa and Nana in the United States. Big, beautiful family. Thanks so much for sharing those photos, everybody. We love to see all your family photos. And we'll show some more next week, too. So if you didn't see them, tune in ne next week for some more. But for now, it's time for us to say our goodbyes. We did so much in the classroom today, playing in the snow, made magic snow, found different shapes and snowflakes. It was lots of fun. And we'll see you next week for lots more in the classroom. Can you wave your hands? Let's sing a big goodbye to everybody. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye to Etienne in Minnesota, Abigail in the UK, Jude from Jordan, and a big happy birthday to Lucas in Ontario and Megan in Buffalo. Happy birthday, you guys. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye to Nora from Ontario. Andy from Chicago, Nora from Brazil, and Tito from LA. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye, Ian, Lisa, and Max from Brazil. Lucia, George, and James from Minnesota. Jafar from Montreal, and Lexi in Texas. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. Goodbye, Julia from Brazil and Allison in Chicago. Darren and Nana in Taiwan, bye-bye. Nova Lee from Ohio and Cody in Taiwan. Goodbye, 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 goodbye. We'll see you next time. Bye, everybody. Come back soon to the classroom for more fun. We'll see you then.